Welcome to our travels to Hong Kong. In this video, we'll take you on a tour of our enormous apartment. We will visit the ladies market and we'll also take a trip on the cable car to Big Buddha. It's going to take a long time for the tour. Go ahead and get comfortable. So, uh, grab grab a, a cup of coffee. <laughs> Maybe a sandwich. Uh, and let's go Make ahead sure and you're well rested for this tour. As you can see, there's a door behind us. And there's the bedroom. <laughs> now, would you like to give us a tour, Jackie? Sure. Jackie will narrate okay, everything. Okay, so here's the bed. Here's the bed. Ooh. Wow. Nice floral pattern. So spacious. Uh, nice little desk area over here, also <laughs> on the bed. And a uh, nice little view. There's a little AC unit up there. Show them the view, Jackie. Ooh, ah. Wow, oh. high rises. Yeah, very okay. nice. Okay, moving on. All right, now get ready for this. Oh, here's the living room. <laughs> Complete with uh, seating on the bed. Here's the living room. <laughs> <laughs> you got a nice little TV here. The TV is the best part. That's where we watch the news and uh, get caught up with Music the, videos. the happenings. Yeah, of, of Hong uh, Kong. Hong Kong. Okay, right, now, moving on. come on over here. Here's the bathroom. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, no, get this, get this. Here's the shower, <laughs> and the toilet, and the sink. This is like- Well, slow down, like, slow down. Okay, okay, okay. Josh, I'm sorry, here's she the, says she gets too excited. Here's the shower. Mm-hmm. Okay. Complete with hot and cold water. Yeah. Yep. <laughs> the toilet, the yeah, toilet. Right. Very nice, very nice. Okay. It's made out of porcelain. The, the sink. And that is the sink. And uh, give give a sense for scale here, because it is... Alright, so here's my hand. <laughs> so show us how you wash your face. So, I wash my face like this, but then the water is like a puddle. <laughs> while, while squatting over the toilet. <laughs> Shower. <laughs> So it's get three in one. <laughs> Shit shower and shave all in one. Shit shower and shave. I've taught Jackie the three S's. Uh, Shit traveling. shower and shave. <laughs> so we're withdrawing cash. Everything here is cash, except cards. Almost nowhere. So we're drawing more money, and um, we're gonna go make our purchases. Fifty. Okay. Okay. Thank you. All right, thank, thank you. you. You're so cute. They're cute. Yeah. We should name them. Yeah. Knock it down from one twenty-nine to fifty. Yeah. <laughs> gotta. So. Gotta be ready to walk away. Yeah. <laughs> we might. So we were just on uh, at the ladies market. The ladies market. And uh, ladies, ladies. Had our first experience um, bargaining, bargaining with the merchants. <laughs> and I just got a this new selfie really stick. <laughs> Where's the old one? Oh. oh, so I just bought a new selfie stick. Uh, she originally tried to charge me 200 Hong Kong dollars. I told her at first uh, 130, and then she was like, you know, like 160, and I'm like, uh, I really didn't want it that bad. I thought it was nice. Um, but I did need an upgrade because this one's getting a little old. We've swam with it a lot. It's getting rusty. Um, but then, you know, I realized we hadn't really seen that many selfie sticks. So I was like, uh, I'm not that interested. We're going to go look for a little bit. Yeah. So was, of course, as we started walking away, she's like, okay, okay, 1.30. And then Jackie's like, uh. Nope. Jackie's, <laughs> yeah. So we played it up and she ended up selling it to us for 100. We were walking away and she goes, okay, 100. <laughs> oh no, it was more like, uh, Yeah, but okay, she said 100. it in a very like exasperated way. Like, oh my God, fuck. Fucking tourists, yeah. <laughs> Americans. <laughs> and then Jackie almost got a purse. <laughs> I almost got a purse, which was originally $1,200. And I talked her down to 200, well not dollars, but the Hong Kong, Hong Kong dollars. dollars. Yeah. And it's pretty awesome. I like bargaining, it's yeah, fun. It kind of just mess with them. <laughs> All right, Jackie, what just one? happened? Oh, <laughs> so you just got a 360 <clears throat> into the air after being in the store with us like, like six Forever. hours. <laughs> it's a long story. <laughs> Success. But we finally got it. So we're super excited. Stay tuned for future 360 degree pictures.
Although you can take a bus up to Victoria Peak, we opted to walk the way up. The memo? Vertical hill. <laughs> <laughs> Run on an urban hike right now. <laughs> I'd say it's unlike anything that we've ever done. <laughs> I mean, it's crazy steep. You look up, and these skyscrapers go on forever. I thought it was a really cool urban hike. And as you climbed up, you would actually be above the level of all the skyscrapers in Hong Kong. And it was the coolest feeling because not only were you going for a hike, but it felt like you were going up a giant escalator up the side of this mountain. He's working double time now. <laughs> Whoa. Hello, welcome this way. Thank you. Two people, right? Yep. Can take it. Enjoy your professional photo. Last call. Oh, wow. Thank you. We arrived to the top as soon as the sun was setting, and as day turned to night, we watched the city come alive. We were really excited for the next day because we were going to hike up to the Big Buddha. Big Buddha, Big Buddha, Big Buddha. Oh yeah, Big Buddha. We're sitting in the camel car and about to go up to the Buddha. Big Buddha is actually 112 feet tall and it weighs over 250 metric tons. It's one of five Big Buddhas across China. Having such an enormous monolith right outside of this huge metropolis was really symbolic of how Hong Kong has really been at the center of so many different cultures and time periods uh, throughout history. Okay, so we made it to the Big Buddha. We're here. There he is. We just climbed the steps. Yeah. Big sun flare. Epic. Yeah, I thought it was really cool. Um, I honestly wasn't expecting much. I was like, Prior to this, I was thinking to myself, yeah, so what? There's a big Buddha statue, what's the big deal? But the scenery is really beautiful, the mountains are really pleasant. The weather today was perfect. Yes, yeah, blue skies and you know the, the statue is so iconic to many people and it was just such an honor to be here and um, be able to experience this with everyone else. I absolutely loved visiting Hong Kong. It was such a neat cultural experience. The food was amazing. We really got a lot of walking in and saw just some amazing sights. Hong Kong was such a quintessential Asian megacity in that it was enormous and housed so many people. But despite that, it operated so smoothly. It was so easy to take the subway from point to point, to take public transportation, and of course, there was this beautiful waterfront, really iconic skyscrapers, and really nice multicultural people. During our trip to Hong Kong, we celebrated Memo's birthday in the most special way we know how, a trip to Disneyland Hong Kong. And after Disneyland, we set our sights on a trip to Philippines. More to come soon. <laughs>